Okay, guys, it's time to count my blessings. So I have been trying to do this video for a while. I actually recorded another one and uh, I am redoing it. So I got up early in the morning. As you see, I'm still in my pajamas. This is an early morning pajama recording. Uh, just because it's almost February, um, I'm recording this on January 31st. And so it's, um, you know, tomorrow's February 1st. And I figured I should go ahead and count my blessings for the new year. Um, it's been <laughs> a tough start to the new year in a lot of ways, but um, what really helped me get through the trying year that 2021 was, was the fact that I was counting my blessings daily. Um, I know I didn't record a video every day for it, but it really helped me out a lot. So starting out in this new year, having a lot of challenges, um, resurgence and you know COVID cases and things like that. Um, more people that I know have gotten COVID. Um, some of them haven't had any symptoms. Some of them have had symptoms. Um, I don't think I've lost anyone else recently to COVID, but it, you know it's still a thing. Um, and you know I'm not here to you know discuss you know your opinions on that or anything. I'm just stating some, you know facts here. And so I've had to take a step back from some things just because um, I want to keep myself safe and all that jazz. And so again, I'm blessed that um, I have a wonderfully supportive husband who helps me in ways that I can't even begin to process a lot of times. Um, I'm, I'm one of those women that um, if, you know, if I was single, and, you know, I would hold down my job and I would pay down, you know, pay my bills and all that kind of like I, that's totally me. And, um, but when you're in a marriage, um, there is kind of like this give and take, you know, I, I'm so blessed that I have a husband who's willing to step up a little bit more to give me that freedom to kind of step back. And the other, there are times when I, you know, stepped forward a little bit, you know, to give him some time. But in this particular situation, he's the one who's going out of the house and going to the grocery store and interacting with the public. And I'm pretty much staying at home, working from home, doing everything from home. I'm not um, engaging with a lot of people face to face right now. And um I'm only able to do that because of um, my husband and I do not take him for granted in any way whatsoever. And so I'm blessed. Um, I am blessed that all of my family is, you know, healthy, you know, for the most part, like I said, um, a couple of people have, you know, had COVID and, you know, some had symptoms, some didn't, but, you know, they're all in recovery um, regardless. And so I am very grateful for that. And, um, you know, I have a lot of um, hopes and dreams and aspirations as usual. And so I'm going to just try to focus on the positive things. Um, I am blessed because I am finding my way. I, I am not where I want to be. I, I have, you know, I've been really struggling with some of the choices that I've made that on one end are totally for the better, but I, it's because it's good over here, but then I have to sacrifice something over here. It's, it's, you know, it's a balancing act. And so I'm blessed that I even have that, you know, there are people out there who don't have a choice, you know, they can, there's nothing for them to sacrifice to have something better. It just is what it is. And so the fact that I have these choices, whether um, they're perfect or not, you know, I'm blessed to have those choices. I um, am writing on a regular basis, even though I'm not writing very much. The fact that I'm writing to me is a blessing because I can literally think of times where I've gone almost a year without really writing anything. And so if it's just, you know, a hundred words a day, that to me, that is, that is something that is progress, you know, um, I'm blessed because um, 
I have a very small Patreon community that just motivates me to do more. Having that in place and having that accountability in place to where I've made a commitment to provide content to this group of people, it's really been um, amazing. And I've talked about it quite a bit already. They're probably tired of me talking about it. They're like, if you don't stop talking about it, we're not going to support you anymore. But I'm just so blessed um, because of that. Um, I think it's really helped me break down a lot of the barriers that I've had with not being able to write the way that I used to. And so I'm just I'm blessed in that way. Um, we've had a lot of um, snowstorms where I've been, you know, roads have been closed in some cases, people have lost power in some cases, you know, we bounced back. And so I've been dealing with a lot of that. It's just so cold outside. I do not like cold weather. I mean, I don't mind it being cold. It's just that when it's so cold that you can't really do anything, that's my issue. And so, you know, this is one of those situations where it's going to be warmer this week, but then it's just going to get right back cold again. So dealing with that a little bit, but um, I do appreciate that our world hasn't been destroyed so much the fact that, that we don't have seasons, because I feel like we're getting very close to that. I feel like I used to have four distinct seasons in my life. There was winter, spring, summer, fall. Now I feel like we have summer, we have winter, and then we have this kind of slush in the middle. It's not exactly <laughs> um, <laughs> spring. It's not exactly fall. I don't really know what it is. It's basically one day it's 80 degrees and then the next day it's 40 degrees. So at least we still have two distinct seasons, you know, <laughs> that's something. Um, but I, I'm blessed in so many ways and blessed that you, you know, you hopefully you're watching this video, you're following my channel. And so, yeah, I just wanted to get this out. I meant to do one um, early in the month that didn't happen, but you know, this is me guys. <laughs> um, I was proud of myself last year for consistently putting out videos, even though I didn't always consistently put out the same videos. For me, the fact that I recorded and posted something throughout the year was just amazing to me. And so I'm going to try to continue with that this year. And I consider that a blessing. So this is me counting my blessings. Um, my heart goes out to all of you. I hope that you are safe and you're doing well. I hope that you are thriving in whatever creative pursuits that you might have. Um, and I um, hope that your health is well and all that jazz. So please, guys, stay safe and be blessed.